And if I ever want to serve anything on this, I can do it right on the top there. <laughs> it's fun doing this. It is fun. This is actually my fourth time in 21 years at Richmond Ballet to do this role. Of course, it changes every time because the company members um, have changed. This is the second time to do this particular role with Brett. And we found our notes from like five, six years ago. We're like, okay, and then I look at them like, ooh. Ooh, what does this mean? <laughs> Lady Capulet is an interesting individual and she is a little bit conflicted because she is the mother of this petulant teenage daughter and she also is trying to be the lady of a wealthy family. From my perspective, I, I sort of look at myself almost as a peacemaker. That's sort of the role that I'm trying to take when I'm looking at this because there is a lot of conflict going on with so many different characters in it. It is so much fun to be on stage with these people that we work with on a daily basis. I dance to perform. That was me particularly, you know. Um, I enjoy taking ballet class, but I really like being on stage. Brett and I both have some serious acting uh, scenes that we have to deal with and, and get our heads around. Well, and I also think that's one of the beauties of this version and Malcolm Byrne as the choreographer is, um, we're, we're really lucky here, both from Judy and my perspective, but the dancer's perspective, that he really does coach. Malcolm is so detail-oriented. He's really thought through every single note of the music, every single nuance of each character, and really how to tell the story using Shakespeare's words. As we're rehearsing, he quotes the text in rehearsal, which is, to me, very impressive. I don't know the text that well, I'll be honest with you, but he's, he's really studied it. It is a beloved production in the Richmond Ballet repertory. The costumes are beautiful, the scenery is beautiful, the dancers are, are absolutely lovely. and The music is gorgeous. It's an evening of great entertainment. And the Richmond Symphony playing it, which is not the norm a lot of times anymore in the ballet world. So to have them in the pit with the visuals that uh, Judy just explained, it's really a, a, a lovely opportunity and hope everyone does come and see it. Are we good?